In recent years, Internet of Things has become something of a buzzword. You probably already know that the Internet of Things is the connected network of objects from wearable tech to cars and buildings or even a refrigerator, which has been embedded with sensors and software allowing the collection of data. Let's take a look at some of the pros and cons. Businesses are increasingly taking advantage of network capabilities to implement machine sensing, although environmental and biological sensing is also on the radar. But what do companies get out of connected devices? In a word, data. According to a survey carried out by 451 Research in 2016, businesses take advantage of the massive amounts of data generated to reduce risks, facilitate product development, and improve customer information gathering and segmenting. An older study from the Harvard Business Review showed businesses using big data to enhance customer service, improve the use of assets, and increase revenue. Algorithms and patterns can help companies discover new ways to reach and impact their customers in a world of increasing consumer choice. What about the consumers using the products? Well, many can benefit from behavioral insights. Take a look at wearable fitness devices, for example. Fitness devices dominate the market for wearable tech, providing information about steps taken or miles walked, biked or swum, calories burned, heart rate, GPS location, body temperature, REM sleep, and more. Users gain a wealth of information about their habits and fitness levels, which they can use individually or show to a doctor to help improve their health. Convenience is another benefit. They may also benefit from efficiency savings passed on by businesses or improved public and private services. Of course, it's not all good news. Computers aren't the only thing that hackers can access these days. Anything with a network connection, from cars to baby monitors, is vulnerable. With ransomware attacks and high-profile security breaches at large companies making news recently, consumers are more concerned than ever about the safety of their data and information. There are other things to consider as well. What happens with all the data collected? Who has access to it? How is it being stored? Are companies compliant with the varying levels of data protection law in the different markets they have customers in? Who is responsible in the event of a breach or misuse? Beyond security and compliance, customers may also feel an invasion of their privacy when they are marketed to based on the profile constructed of data detailing the minutiae of their daily lives. For businesses and governments, there's also the question of processing, managing, and utilizing all of that data. It's a daunting task, even for well-funded and experienced organizations. Those who are just moving into the space might find the costs and setup requirements somewhat overwhelming. Before that can even start, an evaluation needs to be carried out to discover the business needs, set objectives, determine skill gaps, research equipment options, and establish a budget. Once all that is in place, the ongoing collection and management of the data can be a real challenge. What about the future? Well, the Internet of Things is only expected to grow in the coming years, and some governments are already taking action to address the risks. For example, the European Union updated its data protection laws earlier in 2016, for the first time since 1995, adding new fines and regulations which will apply to any company in any country doing business with EU residents. With the increased adoption of cloud technology, businesses may find it easier than before and more cost-effective to store and work with their data. In terms of applications, the possibilities are limited only by the technology. At Syncfusion, we are super excited about the potential. If you're as excited as we are, be sure to check out our big data and dashboard platforms. These offer everything you need to power a complete Internet of Things solution and start at just $3,995 per year for unlimited use. Thanks for watching.